So on global server, I have an account on Japan. So on Japan, I can check these events that pop up earlier than actually in global. So this is what we will get in global later as well. And it seems to be this, the same event as we had in NA before. So what is this event exactly? So we have a bunch of these, wait, where the hell did it go? C stars that we can get. So you can get C stars and this is where you can use path of growth and also your assets tickets. Question I'm going to get, of course, should I use all of my tickets right now or should I wait for them to use them somewhere else? Well, let's look at it. So first of all, we have stuff. So if you do the mining things, like you definitely want to participate in these events because you get three C stars per time. And that's pretty much for all of those events, which you can do multiple times or multiple of your um, summoners. So you get three of those per. Then you also have three per path of growth and three per essence. So technically one per uh, dungeon. Technically two, because if you have the battle pass or the summon pass, whatever you want to call it, you get two. So what does that mean? Well, can we trade that stuff in for it? Does that make it useful enough? So we can get this one, which I think we get a lot of those right now, which is not that great of a trade, I would say. You can get these three, and I think that's not that great of a trade as well. It's kind of okay-ish, but it's nothing too special. Uh, you can get these, but technically this will mean four skill-ups in total, and four skill-ups for... You have to trade in like 200 for four skill-ups, which is okay. Yeah. In this case, we also have a pretty bad trade for Skystones, but we have an unlimited trade for gold. So technically, I wouldn't even think about this, because you're just buying this for 500k gold, more or less. You're buying four skill-ups for, I don't know, also 500k gold. Gold is for sure the best option here, but let's think about it. Is this the way, or is this where you want to spend all your tickets? Like, let's say you save like 500 tickets or 1,000 tickets or more than that. Every seashell or every path of growth you do, you get two. The worth of the sea star is pretty much 5k per, right? So every path of growth you do extra, or every path of growth you do, gives you on the summon pass 10k gold extra. So that is kind of what you're looking at. And normally Path of Growth already gives you about like what 10k. So this gives you pretty much more or less double the amount of what it would be. Plus that's a very good point, uh, Sally. You have the bingo event at the moment. So you actually have a crossover of two events at the same time. This one only counts for Path of Growth. So if you're planning on spending your Essence tickets, I would probably recommend to wait for them. But this one, you get a bunch of gold in here and you get a whole bunch of crystals. So definitely for those crystals, I know, especially the free to play people, you can definitely use those crystals and those will be very useful. So for that, I might recommend to say like, okay, use it. Would you say like, okay, would you maybe not just wait for it and wait for a better event because we're still kind of Akamir event deal. We're still like, we didn't have like a platy event or like there's a whole bunch of events we didn't get or should you just straight up wait for six star runes? Yeah, that's a difficult question. Like six star runes, which comes with Kantana, might be two weeks away by me. Well, I would rather say four weeks away or like two months away. That, that's kind of the thing that I would say that would be nice. But, hmm, six star runes also needs more gold. True, true. So for me, it's it's kind of a hard take. Like I got, I think I saved up like a thousand, like 1100 right now. And I know honestly, I think I would skip on this event. Like I think I will skip. I'm not 100% sure yet. But personally, I think like, of course, I do my uh, my dailies. I do like normally if you don't uh, do the thing of getting extra energy in for Path of Growth, this is definitely the time you do want to do it. But if I want to use the tickets that I get from the repeat quest to do this, I'm not entirely sure. So for me, it's kind of a 50-50 because the gold, it is a good, good amount of gold. Also, if you do this, make sure you only do this during hot time. So they actually made it like a certain thing right now. Therefore, we don't get this event on the moment that the patch happens, because when the patch happens, you don't have this um, hot time event. You definitely only want to use extra tickets if you have the hot time event. So don't do this on Monday. Don't do this on Tuesday. Don't do this on Wednesday or Thursday. Only do this Friday, Saturday, Sunday, because you will get 30% extra gold on top of that. 
So there's a lot of gold to be gained from this one. Definitely a lot and a lot of gold. But will I use all of my tickets on this? I'm not entirely sure. Because, well, you could save it until like infinite and never really get it. Because uh, in NA, the moment they got six star runes, they never got a good event with it. So since today, I think it's the first time that they got a lucky bingo after six star runes. So the moment six star runes happen, you can pretty much be certain that you're only going to get runes from these things and never get like actual good uh, events from your tickets. But then again, would we still get an Akamamir event in two weeks, maybe? Or in four weeks? I don't know. Or do we ever get it? I don't know. So that's the hard part. Since we don't know what kind of updates come, it's very hard to say. Because this update was mentioned that it was going to be. Like the moment they did like a roadmap of like, hey, what's coming next month. They mentioned the Sea uh, Star event or uh, yeah, the Starfish event to be in there, but they never mentioned Akamamir event. They never mentioned Platy event. They never mentioned Charlotte event, which were the last few events that form net fives that were still missing. And to be honest, Akamir event is OP as fuck. Charlotte and Platy event were okay-ish. They were like, from what I've heard from the NA people, you got like six or seven um, copies of that unit. Akamami event, if they would pull out the Akamami event the same way that they did it in NA and in Korea server, you can pull probably like 20 copies. So that event is pretty sick. Charlotte event, yeah, it's nice for Anifal Scallops. I will probably use that for that as well. But yeah, it's a hard take to say like, oh, do you really want to use your gold on this? Like, I would say that if you want to get your master quest in, like master quest costs you about like, 25 to 30 mil depends how far you're at kind of that for that reason getting extra golden is definitely useful but for me it's a hard take i'm still not entirely sure and since we cannot predict what other units are coming later or anything like that it's it's pretty hard to say is that a dark one would have been funny if it was dark but yeah let me know in the comments what you guys think whether you're going to spend your tickets or not. Now and half for global, that's also true. Like we still need, we are actually kind of behind on events in general in global. So hard to say what's good, but definitely if you are getting these things, I would not get anything else than just getting gold. Like all of these might be like, oh, but I'm super close to my transcendence, whatever. Don't get these. It's straight up a waste. Like getting one piece of this equals to 100k gold. It's a bad trade. Also, just buying one of these is 500k gold. You can get those twice per week and twice per month. You already get like 10. Like if you need more than 10 per month, you're kind of doing something wrong somewhere. Like sure, it is equal to account level. It's like 10% or not 10%. It's like 7k HP in account level or whatnot. But... I don't know. Yeah, transcendent stuff is useless after level 70 anyways. Well, in Korea, they added something that it became useful again. But that is something that comes later for us. So that's not entirely something that we can use right now. But we will have enough pieces by the time uh, that comes along, I think. But yeah, that's pretty much for the event.